Hello and welcome to Wheels and Bits and today we're going to take a look at the Twin Piston 12 volt air compressor and the part number in this is WMB XH2005 air compressor and this is Twin Piston compressor so you've got the piston on the right, piston on the left it, with, with being a Twin Piston compressor that means that it'll pump over 85 litres of air a minute which in my reckoning is one of the biggest on the market in a 12 volt pump I did notice just on Wish and Alibaba that there's ones claiming to be like 500 litres of air a minute. Uh, I don't understand how that can be because the simple thing on it is a uh, 200 litre compressor in a, in a garage would hardly pump that. So uh, with this being a large compressor, you'll see that we have the positive and negative uh, bat battery clamp terminals. Uh, this is actually too big of a compressor to plug into the cigarette litter, so that's why it's got that. It's 3.5 metres of power cable. You've got the quick connector which also inflates air beds. You've got the quick connector that connects on to the terminal and you've got it comes with a 3.6 meter power cable and six meters or six and a half meters of airline rail uh, which is coiled so it may appear shorter but when you pull it out straight it's six meters. Now we actually in the video later on when we show actually how this product works and how it functions and in inflating one of our vans uh, you'll see that um, we have that on it and um, you've got the airline gauge um, and then you just your simple on off connector turn or switch a uh, very good weight compressor as i said 85 liters per minute maximum psa of 150 psa and uh, now this compressor is only made to inflate products uh, as in tires uh, to, like your inflatable water beds your inflatable toys uh, it is not designed to inflate a metal Tank. So we're going to take a just a look at the Wheels and Bits Twin Piston Air Compressor Kit which comes in the wee handy carry case. Uh, we're blowing up the tyre on one of the larger Renault traffic vans, it's one of our delivery vans that we use. I just noticed this morning that the tyre was pretty soft on it. Now something that we recommend on these is if the tyre is flat that you actually jack the vehicle up. But we're just going to show you just so that you can see that the um, on even a large van like this here that this compressor and it's a twin piston compressor so on, on it we're just going to show you that like in the engine bay here you have your positive terminal and then you'd have earth mounting points because the battery's hidden underneath the seat in this vehicle so we're just going to show you now what, what how you actually go about this so as this wheat compressor is a quite large twin piston compressor it's 0.25 of a horsepower so it needs a bit more than your just your standard cigarette lighter plug connection so you'll see here we've connected onto the positive terminal in the engine bay as there's no battery underneath the bonnet of this vehicle so uh, they use the power point and then you see here we have the the earth on the body of the on the engine um just to show you now that you, the actual compressor just walks straight to the bat right. now this wee compressor you'll see has got a quick flip connector the quick and flat compressor just connects on to the terminal here and you've got your corded cable with your airline gauge. So you'll see here with just the connector screwed on, you've got your little gauge here. So now all we're just do is ready to turn the weak compressor on. You can hear now that the motor's on a wee bit harder. You see there's 25 pound of pressure in the tire already. And we're just going to give it a um, couple of minutes now to inflate the tire. So this week compressor inflated the tire to full pressure in about two and a half minutes. Uh, what we did notice was it actually worked better and quicker when the vehicle was running. To show you the, the length that the actual vehicle goes, because this is one of the longest vans that you can buy on the market. So it's the Renault Traffic LHL. So it's a long wheelbase, high roof, long overhang. So you'll see there that the actual gauge does go all the way down to the back tires. Uh, thanks for watching our video from the Wheels and Bits team. I um, hope you'd uh, subscribe, press the bell button and like the video as we continue to try and do more reviews on the products.